Hey everybody, Tim Heidecker here, host of On Cinema at the Cinema, and the creator of and star of the Decker movies. I also wrote and directed both Decker Classified and Decker Port of Call Hawaii, which were big hits with the critics and very popular with the public. I wanted to share with you some footage from the set of Decker vs. Dracula that proves my point that Greg Turkington was not only a terrible director, but in way over his head. And while I do carry some blame for giving him this responsibility, I think you can safely see that Greg Turkington is just not capable of handling the situation. What you're about to see is raw, unedited footage, so you can judge for yourself. I think you'll come away from this video understanding why I had no cho choice but to cancel the series. I hope this isn't the end for Decker. I, like you, worry that this misadventure by Greg Turkington could prove a fatal blow to the franchise. I would encourage you, however, to not consider Decker vs. Dracula a part of the Decker canon, and perhaps I can figure out a way for Decker to rise from the ashes of this terrible disaster. If you can stay back a little bit Tighten and not, up. yeah, not Tighten be so. No, but keep that exactly where it is. Okay. But just, it's just when you lean forward, yeah. it's just, oh yeah, it's okay. casting the shadow so we don't need. Shadows are natural. I think they're, they create a sense of understanding where the space is. In other words, you see the yeah, shadows. Yeah, but there's, not, there's no coming. sun in the Oval Office. You know what I mean? Indoors, there's you don't windows. have those kind of shadows. There's windows. I don't know. I'm just saying you should, well, I don't think you should be restrictive in the way you're using your yeah. body, right? Yeah. yeah, but if it makes the scene so the scene doesn't work. Um, oh, oh, I, all I'm saying is, is the light, from what I can see, there's yeah. there's always shadows on faces. and there's yeah. Not indoors there aren't. Well, maybe I can split the difference here. Well, no, because he's not, he's just an actor in this. So I would say just when you lean forward, just be aware. Just keep aware of what, what the shadows are doing. All right. Okay. okay. Thank you, Greg. Thank you. All right. Good notes. Helpful notes. Okay. Okay. So we're we're gonna run. We're gonna get to the next scene. Yeah, but I, I would like a version of that where you're not so negative about things. I'm not giving you another take. Okay. So we can move on, or we can cut. What do you want to do? Just, just do what. I'll act, I'll absorb that into the script. I'm just reading the lines you wrote. You, you, you wrote the line, correct me if I'm wrong, you wrote the line, K Kington doesn't have what it takes. So that's what I'm reading. <clears throat> yeah, just you're putting too much into it. Like, you should be a little, you're All right. saying it, but you don't really believe it because you know Kington. Okay, so you want to do yeah, that whole I'd scene like, again? I'd like another You want another? Well, All right, just, really just, quick. Yeah, really quick. I just think you need to not. Really quick. It just ready? feels like you're really answering okay, it, and that's yeah. not right. Um, from the top of that, uh, Kington. At this point in the shooting, it was becoming apparent to me that Greg was not capable of giving me the direction I need to deliver a great performance. But what happened next proved beyond a shadow of a doubt that Greg had, from the very beginning, had intended to destroy the character of Special Agent Jack Decker. See for yourself and decide. We're almost done, just like, just like one line to go. Yeah, but I'm not saying that we got to do it. We're not, Decker's not going to make a, uh, you just confused. Why is Decker making a deal with uh, Taliban? In order to save the planet from Dracula's huh? Destructicon. No, we're not, I'm not, I'm not going to say that we're, we're collaborating with, with the Taliban. We're not collaborating with the Taliban. It's just you're facing a worse enemy than you've ever faced before. And you're going to have to fight fire with fire to make this work. All right. Well, I'm sorry. I should have. We should have gone over this. But people team up like all the time, like countries and uh, with their enemies. Uh -huh. Just. I mean, is this a, a, a? Do I change my mind then in the next? It makes it like <coughs> the best. 
It makes like the best decker yet because everybody's teamed up for one common foe. You know what I, I mean? Well, so it's I, totally unexpected. No, nah, it doesn't work for me. I just can't. We can't. That breaks all the rules of the universe that I created. In other words, if we just fly out of here, I, the whole idea is that one person in this planet, the only person that doesn't capitulate to terrorism, and to, and to no offense to your character, to everybody else, is Jack Decker. If you start having him deal this ne Neville Chamberlain bullshit, then you don't have a show anymore. No, because so, he's not capitulating to terrorism. Yes, he's he is. Fighting. He just said the line that you have, with Abdul, you have a deal. It's not fucking but Jack line is the worst terrorist that the world not has ever seen. Jack, Jack doesn't exist. What, yeah, but this is the real world we're talking about here, and I'm not going to have the character that I created start this talking about who you start working with. This is a movie world Dracula does exist. He's a far worse well, terrorist. I think what Greg, Greg, than I know. I think what Greg is saying I'm not, is... is uh, I don't care what you think what Greg is saying. Also, saying wait and see, just read the lines and wait and see, in episode 18, you will be vindicated with some of these ideas. Well, you're going to have to change this. Because line. Abdul, you're obviously... You're going to have to change the idea that, De that Decker's making... The, the, in the two-hour finale, it's not like you and Abdul hold hands and go off into the sunset together. Okay, it's Greg, twists let me just that are going to take place. I don't care about twists. Abdul We're never going down that get road. Because what if somebody watches one episode? This is the only episode. What if they watch that one episode and they say that Decker now has made a deal with Taliban? I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to say the line. So I'm not going to make a, give you the option. Well, if they only watch it. one episode of Decker Hawaii, they that, would think that no. Lloyd Arnold was a good guy, and he's not. That's so that's a different situation. We can't make shows for people that Listen, don't can watch we just movies. Take a, all can we all take through. a break? Can we get Mark out of here? I don't want to see him right now. We can get everybody just. I would think you. First of all, you're an hour late with lunch. <laughs> And, but um, if you read the wanna, script for episode 18, I'm you not, see what happens to Abdul. I don't care what happens. I'm not saying it's this part of Decker's not, master grand plan, you see, to defeat I'm all sorry, the terrorists. Greg, I'm sorry, but you I'm cooperate not... cooperate with this terrorist now, you, you defeat change. him later, and especially in the finale, either you where change. the Taliban is going to fall. Okay. Either you, either you change this line, okay, and lose the plot point. I mean, then there's another... Hold on! Either you change this line and you don't make De Decker make a deal with Abdul and and terrorism, it's not a real or deal. I walk. It's a it's a okay. deal of convenience. It's a deal of convenience it's, to stop I, the score. It doesn't of work. Let me oh, explain this to me. As an actor, as a as an executive producer, it doesn't work for me. I'm sorry, everybody, that we've been that I didn't come as fully prepared. Yeah, I'm sorry to you know came with the, yeah, because you have a beard that you weren't supposed to have. It's not in the script. You want to talk about scripts that don't make sense? Okay. Jack Decker is a clean-shaven agent. All right. Well, I'll, uh, he's not a bearded who wants guy. The mic? Does not not with that the kind mic? of beard, especially because that's not a beard that an agent that you would never get security clearance looking like that. Well, I established that with the line. You'd never be president right. with a beard like that either. Okay. Someone take this mic off me. Just do the scene. I promise you, Abdul and the Taliban and all those guys will get theirs in the end. Okay. Um, good luck with the project. If you're not going no, no, to listen to my notes, just because if you're not going to listen to my notes and uh, take my considerations, the sensitivity, I've listened to your notes the sensitivity all day long. that I have for this character and the work that I've done to build this character over five years, and you're throwing it in the trash. I'm not throwing it in the trash. You step away you're from throwing me. throwing my script in the your trash. Your crew sucks. Really it's a shitty environment to make to make uh, entertainment, to make drama. It's it's a disaster. It's the big, biggest mistake of my life that I ever asked you to take. Well, everyone else likes it just fine. We can recast you anyway. And you, uh, if you're smart, we'll, we'll get walk somebody who's clean shaven. And we'll I think everybody should shaven. walk off this set, and show you the respect that you deserve, because you threw De Jack Decker in the fucking trash. And fuck you. We can get someone else to play Jack Decker, somebody who looks the part, because that was not. Jack Decker. You could play Jack Decker. You can do more than one role. Obviously, you did Three Stooges in one night. You could certainly handle Abdul and Jack Decker. You need some time with the script. You want to yeah, take yeah. that in? I mean, we'll probably have to. I don't know if we can keep the stuff we've shot and then shoot and insert scenes. Nowadays, you can do so much without even the actor being there or just well, you know, another person time, coming in. And I'm doing trying it. to direct these scenes, and he's just throwing in his bad ideas every step of the way. So, you know, we probably, probably would have been done with the whole thing by now. I tried to help you, but he he, he doesn't like me. So. No, because he doesn't like anyone that, that outshines his, his star, you know. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you. 
I'm, I'm, yeah, go learn those lines. And let's regroup here after lunch. Thanks, guys.